Hi, I'm Lisa Jane. Jane. So today we want to show you how to clean a big uh, yellow tail. Okay, so in Korea we call Bango and in Japanese they call Kuri. But this fish, when they grow, the name changed four times. So the final stage is called Kuri or Bango. But however, uh, a lot of times when you see this fish in the market, they are all sort of a farm race. And this fish is a sort of a winter staple and very uh, luxury and uh, premium fish. And as you can see, it's pretty big and you know, it's delicious, right? And uh, what she's gonna do is today she's gonna show you how to clean it and you know hopefully uh, you get to see it in a wet set. And yeah, she's uh, good enough to become a sushi chef. So today I'll be the camera person and she will be the demo person today. So what Jane doing now is she's taking off all the fins. So when she scaled a fish with a knife, it will be a lot easier. Uh, most important thing when you're eating a raw fish, uh, you don't want the scale go into the raw fish because that can ruin the experience. So uh, using knife will be a lot more efficient to take off all the scales without damaging the fish. So we are doing it that way. So uh, most important thing, you need to have a sharp knife and the motion needs to be a uh, sewing machine. So you gotta go back and forth, back and forth. And another important tip is uh, you don't cut through the skin so the flesh doesn't get damaged. And you gotta do entire uh, fish. Uh, it will take a little while, but once you get used to it, it will take you know, a lot shorter from the, you know, point you learn.
So after you skinning all the fish, uh, then you cut the head. But you know, the first thing you need to do is go in through the gill, and it will be a lot easier to uh, take off the head later. Then uh, you go to the spine, and there's a little area uh, that which every spine has a little joint. So what you have to do is you cut a little bit and you find the spine and there's a little joint and you go through the joint and it will be a lot easier to cut through that uh, thick bone. and carefully take the odor inside and uh, you wash it thoroughly until it's pretty clean and make sure you gotta take off all the bloodline between the spine and because you leave that uh, the fish gonna turn bad fast As you can see, uh, she's using the plastic spoon to, to scrape the, all the, the line from the spine. But you know, uh, traditionally they use bamboo skewers and other stuff to clean. But like again, the most important thing is if you have uh, any debris or blood in there, uh, the fish is gonna get uh, that faster. So make sure you clean it very well. Okay, that's it guys. Uh, this was Douglas and uh, hopefully you see you guys soon and hopefully you enjoyed the video and thank you very much.